All right, what's going on, dudes? Welcome back to another episode of Ultra Modded Survival. Since we last left off, I did do another live stream. I feel like that's sort of becoming the normal thing, but I like it because when I do have grindy stuff to do, I feel like it's more fun to stream it than it is to just go off camera and try to, you know, grind towards it while listening to music or something like that. Not that it's bad listening to music, but I think I prefer streaming. So if you're interested, once again, if you missed the stream while it was live, you can catch the VOD over on the second channel, youtube.com slash captainsparkles2, or there's just a link directly to it in the description. But I'll also give you a little recap here, which is that I went into the nether. It was basically, as usual, just like a little resource collection stream. So I've gotten some gravel, sand, work towards Tinker's Construct Smeltery, some Norn Nether stuff. Had a lot of that in the last episode, but got a little bit more. Then I also made an alloy smelter so that we can more efficiently, you know, grind stuff down. I can't remember if I had the sag mill or swag mill by its proper name at the end of the last episode. So anyway, I have it just in case uh, I didn't previously so we can more efficiently melt down nether ores and that sort of stuff. So yeah, we're in pretty good shape. That's mostly what I did. Again, resource collection. I saved going and exploring for this episode because we need to go and find some meteors so that we can get some applied energistics presses so that we can make all of the components that we need for the ME system. So I think we're gonna go and explore today and spit on my monitor. You didn't see that. So, <laughs> um, but before we do that, I think I need to make a new ax. Um, I'm thinking emerald, maybe, because I've got a whole bunch of those. So that seems like a, a good material to make it out of. I don't know that I want to waste any of my, um, my amethyst because I don't have too many of it. So we'll go with a nice emerald ax. Now we can sort of just toss out my stone one. As much as you've served me well, I think it's time to upgrade. Oh, I made this beautiful shovel too. Emberstone shovel, it's pretty sick, isn't it? So I made that from um, the Emberstone, which I found in uh, in the stream as well, which is over here. It's pretty cool, it's by killing this super gnarly boss looking dude who uh, wanted to take us out, but we, uh, we had other plans here. Also, on the topic of finding things, we found our first ore spawn ores. I was like, I realized during the stream, I'm like, we haven't found any of these, have we? It's been a super long time, and I'm wondering if we have a problem. And then lo and behold, I found one. So we're gonna spawn a crab. I hope it's not like a giant killer annihilation crab, but you know, we may as well do it as our first one, no matter what it may be. So, uh, spawn crab, please don't kill me. No, oh, it's, ow. Oh, it actually is kind of painful. Are you mad because you're out of water, or do you not need water? Um, why are you sitting? You're really slow. It's probably because you're out of water. <laughs> How sad. I kind of feel bad that I'm going to hurt you, but oh well. Maybe you have a cool cool drop. Can I hit you, actually? Oh, there we go. Wow, you have some serious armor, actually. What in the world? Only five? Yeah, but at least I'm, like, freezing him up. Wow. Dude, this guy has some serious damage resistance. What in the heck? All right, you need to... I'm just gonna get rid of all the flowers. <laughs> God dang it, man! No! I'm ruining my garden out in front of my house! This is awful! Look at this entire cleared out batch. What have I done? It's terrible. Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. Do we even get anything from him? Not really. Alright, fair enough, crab. You're overrated. Whatever. Hey, at least it was the first ore spawn dude that we spawned using the, uh, the ores that we spawned with. In ore spawn. Spawns and ores and ores and spawns and, you know, pretty, pretty cool. All right, anyway, let's toss some stuff back and then we'll get ready to go and explore. Actually, you know what? Before we do that, I promised everyone in the stream <laughs> that I wasn't gonna forget to make a tornado siren because we had what looked to be a thunderstorm coming in and I was like, we should make a tornado siren. And then I was like, no, we should do that in an episode. Everyone's like, no, you'll forget. You'll forget, jarred on you so forgetful. And I'm like, no. So I wrote it down on a notepad, and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make a tornado siren. I think I need gold, redstone, and iron if I remember correctly. So we're gonna grab some of those. Gold, redstone, where did, did I use up all my redstone? I hope I didn't use, I think I used up all my redstone. Well, oops. Let me check that up. Tornado siren, we need a tornado sensor first. That requires redstone, which I seem to have you know, oh, hey, another redstone. That's cool. I'm just gonna go and use that really quickly. All right. Otherwise, I probably will forget to do it if I go out next. Um, is that gonna? Oh, it's gonna do it real quickly. All right. Alloy smelter. Hook it up. We do need to work towards an octodick capacitor. 
that is so we can speed this up like eight times or so. I assume that's what Octodick means, sped up eight times. Something like that. Hey, there we go, redstone ore. Oh god, do I have to smell you again? Well, I mean, sure. Uh, Alright, that's that's cool. Not a big deal. And then wait for it. Wait for how many do I get from you? Do you multiply it? I hope you multiply it. Come on, please. And how many? Only three. Uh, oh, and then six. Maybe I put, I should have put that in the swag mill. Whoops. Too late. Oh, well, redstone's not really a big deal. So, all right, now we can get our iron, which I think I put in there. Yup. Okie dokie. And tornado siren sensor. Boom. Boom. And I still need more redstone for it. Whoops. All right. Uh, thankfully, I think we're going to have just the right amount. It's almost like I did the math beforehand. I didn't. But... Hey, we can pretend. So there we go, and then tornado, siren, boom, sweet. And we'll just place it down right over here or something. I don't even know. Oh, B, you want you want some? You want to terrorize my cows? No, you don't. I don't think so. I don't think. Actually, let me just clear this out real quickly, so that we have plenty of space as we go and explore and stuff. And yeah, it's gonna be great. Cool. Get rid of you. Do I really need flint and steel? While I'm exploring. Probably not. Don't really need you. Don't really need you. I'll take the shears in case, and yeah, we are ready to go and explore. Should be fantastic. Let's do it. Let's go off and find some amazing meteors, right? All right, sounds good to me. Here we go. I hope I have enough. You know what I should do is I should find a horse. That'd be a great idea. That way I can sort of explore without having to worry about, you know, losing hunger and all that, because this has been such a pain so far dealing with that. And there was a horse over here. Hold on, maybe I should go and try taming a horse. Maybe that would be the way to go. So let me grab some wheat. Fro Fish frog prince is all over the place. Just really, 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 really wanting to be turned into, well, frogs wanting to turn into princes, I suppose. All right, anyway. And yet we still have our girlfriend over here just hanging out. Um, oh no! Don't! Don't do it! Don't do it! You're bad! You're bad! Why? Why are you trying to attack me? I'm just peacefully farming! Why would you do this to me? Oh, rude! That was so... That was so uncalled for and not cool. And why are you still buzzing after you died? That's weird. Post-mortem buzz. Apparently that's a symptom of being a bee. So I know, cows, it was, so, it was such a scary, traumatic experience. I know! I know! I, I don't blame you for mooing like crazy. I would do the same. All right, we're, oh, is there another, no, no, not another bee. All right, we're, God, not the bees, man. Actually, you know what, I don't know why I'm getting wheat, because as much as that may be able to heal the horse, I still need a saddle, so, yeah, never mind. Forget about the horse deal, but you want to see something cool that I got in the stream? It's called a gravity blaster, and I thought it'd be really cool because you could use it on other players, but I misinterpreted the description of it, so, hey, we'll bring it along. What it does is it's, Disappears in my inventory. Uh, it launches player into air. I thought that means if you point it at another player, it launches them into the air, when in fact, it just launches you into the air. Whoop! Okay, or it just, you right click on it. Whee! And don't kill me. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Um, I could bring it along if I wanted to, like, make a quick escape or kill myself. Either of the two. Anyway, alright, let's just do this thing. We're gonna go with Explorer, see if we can find a meteor, and it should be... Great, I'm gonna set off in this direction. I'm kind of glad that I killed the bee because it gives us a little bit uh, of extra food, which isn't too bad. Hey trees, how you doing? I'm gonna not, I'm gonna not deal with you. Like, it's cool, it's cool. Oh yeah, we got, dude, we got a slime island up in the sky over there. I'm hoping we'll run into some pretty cool stuff. All right, so another thing that I did, this is actually kind of a big thing that I did. Um, oh yeah, of course I didn't have the swag mill back at the end of the last episode because I, I installed, um, Whoa, okay, I got a speed boost. Um, of course I didn't because I installed Ender IO and Big Reactors. So check it out, check it out, check it out. So if I search like Conduit, for example, which is a lot of Ender IO stuff, here we go. We got some Ender IO, which is pretty awesome. And then I can also search for Reactor. So now we've got all the Big Reactor stuff. So this way should help us out as we're trying to do anything technical. Oh, hi. This is kind of cool. What's up, man with massive sword? Are you guys friendly? Oh, you're just chilling. What's up? Whoa! Hey! Oh my god, this is amazing! I didn't know this was a thing. Hello, Wanderer! We orcs welcome you to our village! Uh, really? 
Whoa, dude, you're awesome. All right, thanks, man. What about you? Yo. Oh, I was expecting that I was gonna- Hey, what's up, man? Hello, Wanderer. Do you need some help in your quest? I train the best wolves in this area. Oh, man, I wanna- Dude. Wow. This is amazing. Oh, my goodness. What's up, man? Hello, adventurer. Do you need something? Trade. Oh. Yo. How do I get this? What do you want for it? Um... Oh, the hookshot, too, and all that stuff? How do I get this? Oh, my God. This is so cool. Um, yo, anything to do. We found a giant monster menacing our village. If you want to go hunt him, uh, take their skins here, and I can craft you orc special armor. Where can I find it? It's a giant bull. You'll find it around 200 meters north. Yo! All right, 200 meters north, you say. Where is north? Over there. I'm totally going to help you out with that giant bull that's been terrorizing your village. Are you in the same... Okay, you just welcome us? Wow! This is so cool! Do you have anything in here? Oh my goodness. Guys, this is awesome. I'm totally... I'm totally going to help you out with stuff. How do I... Get, I don't know how to get this, though. What's up, Wolfie? How's it going? Dude. Alright, don't worry. I'll save you. I'm going to save you from that... Terrible menacing bull that's 200 meters north of here. Let's go get him, dude. He's gonna get shreked so hard. I'll show you for terrorizing the poor orcs. When aren't orcs usually bad? I feel like orcs are generally like it kind of has a bad uh, connotation to the word. But where are you at? 200 meters north, huh? I'm looking for a bull. Looking for where are you? Hmm. Hmm. I'm wondering if I, like, <laughs> activated it properly. Oh, there it is. I totally see it over there. Do you see it? I see it. What is that over there? What in the world are you? Please be friendly. Please don't be mean. Don't be mean. You're, you're nice. Are you just something I could trade with? What's up? Realm Shifter. Oh, my God, dude. What's up? Oh. Oh, I can trade you for copper. Why would I ever want copper coins? Can I just get rid of my copper coins? That's really what I need to do. Can I, can I reverse trade? No. He's like, nah, we like to give you copper. Fair enough. Oh, there he is. The dreaded bull. Oh my god, he has 900 health. Ho <laughs> ho! Uh, yeah, about that. Yo. Are you... Dude, he's terrorizing the poor cows. Get shrekt, bud! Ow! Oh, he kicked me in the face. What are you doing? You're you're kicking. Don't kick me in the face. Ow. He can't. Why can't you move? Ow. God dang it. Uh, there's some laggy stuff going on. What in the? Whoa. Oh. Oh, there he goes. Holy crap. I'm gonna punch you in the face. Stupid bull. Boom. Get wrecked. Oh. Yikes. Yikes. I feel kind of bad. He just sounds so helpless. What are you doing? What are you do what are you doing? Are you even oh whoa 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 that shockwave ow That's actually ow what the ow ow help save me Silly bull you can't swim I'm gonna really really damage my sword though doing this freaking derpy bull <laughs> No ow god dang it not again you and your shockwave you're running what are you doing you're gonna run off a cliff That doesn't seem very smart I wouldn't advise you to run off a cliff unless, unless you really feel like dying. This is such a derpy bull. Ow! Not the shockwave thing again. Not the shockwave! Oh, you're done. Get wrecked. Get wrecked off the cliff. Ow! I don't take no crap from no bulls. And you're done. Woo! There we go. Nice. I got his bull leather. Yeah. There we are. Nice. All right, let's go back to the village, and and they'll be like, "You saved us. Thank you so much for all your help. You're the best adventurer ever." We're like, "Yeah, you know, holidays work. I'm away to try to find some meteors. That's what I do. I don't leave my fellow countrymen to the wayside as long as they're friendly." All right. Well, there goes my um. Hey, ow, ow, ow! Stop. That's not nice of you to do. I wish you wouldn't do that. Uh, anyway, gravity cannon, I don't need that there. Alright, on my way back. On my way back. That was so awesome, though. It was like, yo, save us, adventure. And I was like, yeah, don't worry, I got your back. And then they then I saved him 
from the bull, the derpy bull. All right, let's go back and friggin' be their champion. Yo, what's up, orcs? I've got I've got some stuff for you, so you can be safe. Yeah, hey man, what's up, dude? He's like, oh man, you're pretty sweet. Yo, um, anything to do? Found a giant monster. Um, if you want to go hunt him, where can I find it? Two hundred. I already hunted it. Yeah, nice. You're successfully following the path of a warrior and helping our village. I'll be pleased to craft you some equipment if you collected enough materials. That's sick. All right, what's up? Do you need? Do you want the the bull leather though? This reminds me of Tale of Kingdoms. Tale of Kingdoms was like the one other main mod in the first season of modded survival that unfortunately wasn't updated in 1.7. I think it's it's back on 1.5 now, so I wasn't able to include it. But this is really cool. So what will you craft me? Oh, bull boots. Whoa. Okay, that's kind of cool. So plus one attack damage. Huh. So if I grab. A chest. I wonder how I can grab it. Oh, so it like auto crafts as long as I have the resources. That's really cool. I should have grabbed the bull helmet. That would have been awesome. All right, so I get plus one attack damage if I wear these. Except I don't know these bo these boots down here are probably way more valuable, but I don't know. It's plus one attack damage. Awesome. All right, bros. Dude, I feel like I need to protect your village or something. I should put down some blocks in front of it, maybe. Unless, hey. Don't you be- Oh, that's what was making the crazy sound. Get out of here, Dicer. You're rude. Slowing me down. Don't you dare attack my buds here in the village. Got enough chipmunks eating sand, apparently. <laughs> All right, anyway. I guess we're going to continue on our uh, hero's journey adventure, trying to find some meteors so that we can get some sweet stuff. Uh, but I might check back in there later and keep on doing some, some quests. Um... I don't even think I need to mark that off. It's close enough to Jerry's tree, and I know which direction I headed in for it, so... Let's keep on going! Fussro squid! Alright, back on through the forest. So, we're trying to find... A, uh, whatchamacallit? An ME Applied Energistics Meteor. Which, uh, on the inside of it, has some pretty sweet presses that we kinda actually need in order to make an ME system. As per AE2. So, let's go find them! It'll be awesome, and yeah. All right, here we freaking out. Why am I? God dang it! That's really of all the things that I wanted to have happen. Getting poisoned isn't one of them. What's up, black sheep? How are you doing? Okay, I feel like it shouldn't be that difficult to find a meteor. We all we have to do is look on the mini map, and let me just make sure we're zoomed as far out as possible because it should be pretty obvious. That is kind of. I'm not good. It might only have one elf, but I can't kill it. Oh man, this is cool. Redwood forest? I kind of want to just... This is a cool hike to go on. I don't know. It's just cool to explore with biomes of plenty, because I don't think we've seen a bunch of these biomes before. So, it's like, why not just take a nice hike and wander through the, the woods? So, it might also be worth it to... If we... Whoa, 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 what is that over there? If we wanted to go mining here, when we, I, I need to generate new chunks. A little bit of lag there. But lag, I need to generate new chunks so that I can get Eulorium from them because obviously in the uh, initial chunks where I started in, before I had uh, big reactors and salt, we're not gonna get any Eulorium generating. So I could either go and try to mine stuff here or what are you, what are you guys? What are you, uh oh, uh oh, we got some angry stuff. Got some angry stuff. We either mine here or we could wait until we get a quarry and do that then. I'm not really sure, but either way, what is is this chocolate quest? It kinda looks never miney. Whoa. Yo, what a dungeon dungeon master? Welcome to the arena. Do you want to participate? Arena easy, arena Arena manager stares at you. Uh you don't want you don't want me to participate. Alright, fair enough. <laughs> arena this way. Dude, how do we get in here? Okay, what's up? So I go down. Oh! What? Uh. Hey, skeletons. Are we but? No, you're not! I was like, are we buds? Are you angry? You're all angry. Why are you so angry? I shouldn't. I. Uh. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna kill you. Why would you do. Why would you guys wanna fight me? What did I do? This is just a, it's just a gladiator's arena. Don't back off on me. We're here to fight! We're here to frickin' fight and stuff and yeah, get. Don't you back up on me. Don't you back up. Ow. Ow. 
No, don't. Uh, whoops, we crashed. All right, we're back battling skeleton bros. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're very dead. Um, and you're dead too. Okay. Oh, that's weird. I'm like expecting them to drop drop stuff, but I assume because it's arena that they don't. All right, so there we go. And yeah, we win. What's up? Do you see that amazing victory, Mr. Arena Manager? God, you look so professional. It's amazing. Uh, do you want to participate? Arena in progress. What are you talking about? Come speak to me once you've completed the arena battle. Oh, there's more to it. All right. Apparently, that was only wave one. Hmm. Well, what do we have next? Any Anything more? Hello? Anybody? I don't see anything else, man. Do you, do you have some other stuff for us? Something like that, because I don't see it. Unless my crash messed everything up. Uh, might be a thing that, that is... God, there are a lot of mobs out there. Mother of Minimap. Um, yeah, dude, Mr. Arena Manager. I don't know what you're talking about, but... Eh... Yeah, can I... What if I eh, abandon the arena? I don't know. Well, you know what? I... <laughs> I think we may actually go ahead and wind down the episode here. Oh, it's the creepy Enderman dude. Um, that was some really cool stuff, though. I am amazed that Chocolate Craft has gotten so freaking awesome, and that makes me really excited. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> cool. Well, I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, a rating would be super duper awesome. Very much appreciated. And maybe we could go for something in the line of 42 likes on this video. That would be super sweet. So, anyway, thanks again. And when we next resume, maybe I'll figure out how to make the arena work or something. We'll see. All right. Uh, see ya.